live comedy from Bazaar. Honestly, Mum, I've married a wonderful cook. Aunt Doll's wedding present was a Moulinette master fry. What a boon. Debbie makes chips any time I fancy. No spitting, no smoke. But the magic is, the master fry cleans your oil every time with this throwaway paper filter thing. Of course, Mum, I can truthfully say, the master fry doesn't make chips like you do. You feel more at home. Dory, she wants some secateurs. Oh. What do you want, John? Ah, uh, oh, I'd like some coffee, please. Mm. Really? Yes, Maxwell House, all that fresh, natural flavour. Uh, it just seems rather odd to give someone at Christmas. Why? You can have Maxwell House at any time. All oh, right, if that's what you want. Uh, do you want some as well? Uh, it's very sweet of you, but I still think I prefer that little pink nighty we saw. Right. Fresh, natural, Maxwell House. If you want very good interest on £100 or more and can give seven days' notice, there's no puzzle about where to put it. To the question, is it chicken oxo that brings out the flavour of chicken, or chicken that brings out the flavour of chicken oxo? There is no answer. One brings out the flavour of the other. It's a little like asking which came first, the chicken or the cube. Eddie's not drunk nearly enough to be sick, but he's going to be just the same. He'll be sick when he finds out he's been going a bit over the speed limit and that his rear light's on the blink. He'll be even sicker when he sees that it's not just the loonies the coppers can spot. They must think we were born yesterday. And when they take his licence away, he'll be sick for a whole year. Think before you drink, before you drive. Good evening. The Saturday match is coming up later tonight on TVS with two games from the First Division plus FA Cup action from Portsmouth and Aldershot. Before that, though, boxing and Mike Weaver defends his heavyweight title against Michael Dokes. That's at 10.40, followed immediately by the Saturday match. <laughs> Now on TVS, John Wayne stars in our film, True Grit. 